Hello everyone, something up to welcome to another mod overview, this time on Fluid Tank. A mod that simply adds in fluid tanks that you can use for obviously storing fluids in. So it adds the following. It only works on water and lava. I don't assume it's going to be supporting other fluids eventually, but who knows. Find out, and it allows for up to 15 buckets. Instead of some that obviously store about 4, 8 or otherwise. So let's go tank here, and I'm just going to do this. Now we've got fluid tanks here, and we've got the tank. So we've got this, which is iron and glass, or stained glass if you have access to it. And fluid tanks here is block form, which is stone, and the four of those. My guess is these are just a component, they're not like a portable version. Um, so we don't really need to cover those, I think. Let's get water, for example, and test that. Yeah, it is just a component. That's fine. I can go one, two, oop. Okay, so it's not going to work for me in creative. Interesting. It's got one, two, three, four. I really wish I didn't have to constantly keep clicking this GI, but oh well. Um, and etc, etc. You can see how much it's filling up there. And if obviously you had pipes and otherwise you could send this to them or out of it. Um, speaking of, I do have some mechanical pipes, for example, I could use this for. I could go this, this, they don't join, so there is that as well, just a single block. That's not going to work, apparently. Do I have a pipe of other kinds? I do have a uh, basic fluid pipe that might work. Okay, so they may not connect to others. I don't think I can just use the servo. Filter on this either, I forget what it's called. Um, extraction. I don't think that's going to change anything. That ain't going to change anything. I guess it's intended to just be a simple tank. You can just store stuff in and do by hand. Go water here. It's still the same supported fluid. And let's see. This. Nord. White list. Extract mode. Nothing. I don't think specifying here either really changes much. So yeah, if you want to just store water and lava, um, and then easily take it in and out with a bucket by hand, you can do that. And I assume you can easily pick them up with a fist. Yes, you can. So you don't have to use a pickaxe. And obviously you can see the amount of um, buckets stored in the actual name and the technical name as well. Which is interesting. Okay, so there's no tooltip or something else, it's just in the names. So that's cool. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I guess we could try others, but I assume it's, like it says, not going to support them. Uh, what else have we got here? We got mechanism. Yeah, just go with that as well. Let's try any of the three that I've got access to here. Just to properly show, it ain't going to put it inside this tank. So only water and lava, as it says. And obviously to test lava, we can see it works perfectly by now. Thanks so much for watching, and goodbye.